think. Yep. Yes, and it's the next morning. And the sun's out too. Sure. Here, you Islanders have a lemon too. There it is. Ah, nom, 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 Munch, munch, munch. <laughs> So yes, Islanders. So only a few days left until he's gone. And he's considered considered um, pretty much. I think he's extending it to five days now. Oh, well, that's good. That'll give me more time. So I think I've probably got today to do to do something then. Hmm. <laughs> I'll see you on this later. Okay, it's a lot later on. It's the afternoon now. It's from 1.40. And... Things like they might be sleeping or something. But anyways, it's 1.40 in the afternoon now and it's a pretty sunny day. As you can see up there, very, very sunny. And I do apologise for the shorter video length um, in the last episode. Sleep and then I've been waking up several times throughout the night. But anyways, <coughs> we're keeping things cool for now, and um, yeah, and so like that will be away on Monday, the twenty fifth of January. Which means that the 25th will be the last time that you'll see him this month. So 
Phillips decided to extend his stay for about a week. So that means that the very last couple of days of January, you'll see him again. And yeah, and I'm hoping that it, that it, that that it will be the case because hmm, because it would be nice to you know talk with you Islanders without psychic dad breathing down my neck every every five minutes like he has done <laughs> um, and <clears throat> I've actually got other things going on too and luckily for me um, everything will be fine Because we're going to be having smooth sailing the whole time that he's gone. Alright everyone, well. That's all I have to say for now. And as you can see. That's the backyard outside. I also bought some toilet paper because we actually are running out. Look at how many rolls we're down to now, just one. So I think I did a, I, I basically did the right thing as look, we'll get down to that, and one in there. So I've got another 36 down there. Psycho Dad is sleeping because the owls, because there was an owl keeping him up all night last night, so so he's asleep right now. Um, I'll leave him alone, of, of course, because, you know, if, 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 if I heard the owl and it kept me awake all night, I would probably do the same thing. Anyway, Islanders, um, I'll catch you later. Okay, Islanders, we're at the end of the day now. It's quarter past six now. Thought I saw a curly there for a minute. Alright, well, not to worry though. Um, but yes, everyone, as you can see, um, yeah, nothing's different really. Um, yeah, nothing's different. Everything's been kept the same, pretty much. Um, hmm. It's got horse racing playing on the TV. <laughs> Muted, of course. They've got the thing muted. He's got it. He's got. He's got horse racing muted on his TV. Let's see what we've got in here. Well, all that we've got in here is another IGA magazine, which is not interesting, in in to say the least. Because this is only good for pretty much the whole time that circuit adds away. Because he's going to be away for like a week. So he's not going to be able to take advantage of most of these offers on here. Um, I'll, I'll have a read through them off camera. But unfortunately I don't think there would be anything that he'd be interested in. Um, and he won't be able to take advantage of it. Because he's going to be going away to Moonborough. And they don't have IGA in Maryborough. Well, at least to my knowledge, they don't. So, that's that done, and... Hmm. So, I'll be holding the fort down here, 
um, for about a week before he returns. And when he returns, um, well, it'll be all good. Um, yeah. So, yeah. Um, I've also decided to, uh, I've decided to go to the live show um, at QPAC this February, so this February um, I'll be pretty lucky to actually go there, because I'm actually going there um, early February, so expect to see another mainland video um, this February, and oh, more good news to that, um, um, as well, it is the 22nd. So, you know what that means? Face masks are no longer mandatory for Southeast Queensland. Woo! So I'm quite, I'm quite happy about that actually. So, face masks no longer mandatory. Alright, that's enough of the news. So... Um, it's time for us to end off the episode here. I know, I know, I said, I know, I said that I had a, a previous episode shorter time, but I still have to do one in at least eleven minutes. So, thanks for watching this episode of Island Life. Leave a like, follow, please. And I'll see you in the next episode. Goodbye, Islanders.